Hey guys, my name is Anastasia and today we'll be talking all about Queen Mary, the assumptions that you could have and just give you a general idea about what my uni that I've been at for a year now is all about. My thought process on this was that I wasn't just going to tell you what pros and the cons are because truthfully it depends on your opinion, it depends on what you are looking for at a uni and many many more things. This is why I have used my Instagram. I basically did a poll, I screen recorded everything, we've got quite a few to go through and what I thought was that basically I would organize them in categories just for you to not just get a whole bunch of information and be like okay what do I do with that now. Let's start with with location. So Queen Mary is in East London. If you have done a little bit of your research, a lot of people say that it is not the safest area. I remember when getting in Queen Mary, my best friend's mother gave me a call and she was like, be careful. It is not London how you know it. Every big city has its beautiful areas and it's very, very safe areas and a bit of more sketchy areas. And I don't think that it's something that should hold you back from going to Queen Mary. Whilst East London is not the safest, it is like in every big city, you just have to be careful. The reason people say that it's so unsafe is because obviously we're surrounded by a canal, we're surrounded by parks, we're surrounded by a poor community perhaps, but the fact that we have a closed campus makes it feel really safe because we've got security guards all the time. Overall, obviously be careful, but don't let it hold you back from picking Queen Mary at all. Another thing about the location is, as I've said, it is not central London, so every time you'll go out, you'll have to take the tube or take the bus or take a cab. The good thing is, is that we're so close to the Milan station. It's like a five, six minute walk that honestly you can get anywhere pretty, pretty fast. Another thing about the location is that because we have a campus and we're still in London, you kind of get a mix of both a lifestyle that you would have gotten if you were at, I don't know, the Uni of Nottingham, the Uni of York, the Uni of Exeter that is very campus-based, and the London lifestyle. Queen Mary is really the only uni that can give you that. And yeah, I'd say if you're quite unsure of what you want, then obviously having a campus the first year and being in London can be a very, very, very good mix of everything that you could get. All right, so now the social aspect of the uni. First of all, one of the biggest points I should make and that a lot of my friends have made is that it's very culturally rich, very international. And that's really what Queen Mary is known for. You meet new people, you meet people from diverse backgrounds and you hear many, many languages. Another good thing about the campus social aspect is that we have a gym, we have a library, we have a coffee shop, we have Starbucks, we have The Curve, which is our cafeteria, and that makes you 100% bump into people. So if you are shy, if you don't feel like you know going up front to people, you'll kind of be forced you know, to just meet people and, and directly make new friends, and I feel like that's such an amazing aspect about our campus. And even people that commute, I have friends that commute, and actually by going to classes with them or meeting friends through friends, it just happened to be that that we all have a huge friend group. There are also flat parties all around the campus every single night, and so the likelihood of you meeting people pretty high. The Student Union at Queen Mary organizes so many things that you will 100% end up meeting new people. We have a lot of societies, like hundreds. You'll at least find one or two that really interest you and I think that's a good starting point. So another thing that I think I should touch up on, and I didn't really know how to call it, but I'd call it like the uni image, what people see and hear when they see Queen Mary. People have mentioned the fact that the image isn't the best and I was really wondering why. I think perhaps it's because the uni is a a bit more flexible. I mean, it wasn't for my course specifically, but the Russell Group Uni, and you can't close your eyes on that. That list of uni has a super high reputation. It is on the list with Augsbridge. It's on the list with many amazing universities. And overall, I would say it does add to a prestige. It depends on your course, and I think it's always really important to look at your course's ranking. Now let's talk about classes. Now, I haven't had the usual experience of going to a class <laughs> at Queen Mary because because it was still COVID, so we had online lectures and only had in-person classes. I really relied on my friends that did one year before. I have replied to my story. I'll just 
you know, give it to you and take it with a pinch of salt. The good thing about the organization of classes is that it's all on QM Plus, which is a portal where we have all our lectures, our homework, our readings uploaded, and tutorial questions. And also we have MISIS, which is the more technical thing where we have, I don't know, accommodation information, our student information, and all that. So really we have two platforms. It's been really easy to use, and I've had everything I needed on there for the entirety of the year. So overall, like, pretty good with, like, the class classes on the material side. It's not guaranteed that you will be happy with your tutors, but isn't it what life is about? Like, you know, you won't always like your teacher. I think the biggest point that my friends have made is strikes. We've had a huge amount of strikes and I wouldn't put that to the image of the uni directly because so many unis have had them as well, but it has, you know, obviously impacted us. And finally, I want to touch upon literally the most important thing ever. I was so excited about this uni and that other unis maybe have less or that are less known for but it's a hundred percent the opportunities and the abroad years and experiences you can get oh my god i can never talk about those enough queen mary gave me the opportunity to study two years in paris at la sorbonne and actually get a master one out of that I have friends that are doing law in european law and that are literally getting the best options to go to europe i mean i've heard australia i've heard the us and there are good unis for the most part and it's so exciting that a uni would give you such an opportunity you'd get a university of london degree from queen mary you also get you know a year abroad somewhere else and i mean being an international student i value international relations and international experiences so so much so i would say if this is something you're interested in queen mary i mean i've heard it's super flexible with it i've heard it's um, possible with many degrees and if you just look on the website check what you're interested in degree wise and see the year abroad options I promise honestly you could really be amazed i am so excited for mine i love london so much but i think it's so amazing to also experience other unis see what you like what country you'd be interested in working later on and having experiences and live in and yeah i mean overall i am excited about this uni i think it's got its negatives but also its positives it's just a uni that is unique in itself i don't want to sound extra enthusiastic about the uni but i think it's got a lot to offer i think everything i say and everything anyone says you should take with a pinch of salt because anyone's experience is extremely different very subjective and i think that the most i try to do is take everyone's opinions from my instagram poll what i've heard what i've experienced and what people have told me and kind of mix it all together try to come visit the campus try to dm me or dm people that have gone to queen mary and try to make your own idea of the uni because i remember watching this video years before even applying to uni up to like a day before heading to uni literally to see what to expect for queen mary and honestly i feel like these videos are always relevant to give you an idea or let you know what you could experience i think you know any video and any information is good to take and i hope that mind actually helped you kind of you know reassure you of where you're heading or reassure you where you've applied to at the end of the day your uni experience will be the one that you make for yourself thank you for watching see you next time